today at One Source Trucks in Burkeville, Virginia. I am featuring a 2010 Bluebird 44 passenger bus. Um, this is a 86,000 mile rig, so super low miles. And I'm not gonna lie, I am way more excited about this bus than I probably should be. Everything when it works, everything is super clean. Like, this is the condition that this bus came in to us. It is a school bus, yes, but it was owned by the federal government. So this has not actually been, owned, been used as a school bus. I've got Aaron inside, he's helping me out today. Like I said, everything works. So we're gonna, he's opening the door. Gonna activate our stop sign, which blinks and does all the things it's supposed to. It's got the little guard on the front. Your lights on the top there work. So this bus is in full, ready to work, rock and roll school bus fashion. Uh, this does have a six, seven Cummins motor. This is a 44 passenger. Excuse a little bit of kind of grass and debris that we've gotten in it. But I mean, y'all look, this is clean. Normally at these types of miles, you've got all sorts of fraying and lifting on the entryway. You don't have that here. You've got all your little entry handles. This bus has a glove box, all right? It has a lockable factory glove box. I have never seen that on a bus before. It has two air conditioning units. Um, in the back and they are both blowing cold. It is, I don't know, 75 degrees here today. And those things are blowing cold. Let's see, I got a little bit of a glare, so I'm gonna try to get you in. Ugh. Okay, you'll have to look at the pictures because I promise it's 86,000 miles. We have driven this bus extensively and it rides out great. Um, the radio does work, but I have it turned off just so it doesn't compete with what I'm trying to say today. The controls on this are surprisingly like user friendly. When you're sitting here using all these controls, I am actually really surprised at how easy they are to find and use. Both little fans work. I had them going earlier. Can you turn this on? Yeah. I don't know if you can see that, but that little guy is spinning and that little guy is spinning. All right, so I think that's all the things in the front. It is an automatic transmission. And then the back of this thing, y'all. This is as clean as I think I have ever seen a multi-passenger bus come in. There are no rips. There are no tears. There are no stains. There's no foul or funny odors. It actually smells like new car plastic. The roof is pure white. It has all sorts of speakers throughout. Like I said, the radio does work. You've got um, upgraded LED lighting. You've got your rear air conditioning unit. The front air conditioning unit, they are both blowing nice and cool. You've got your little traditional kind of half seat back here. There's no graffiti on the backs of the seats. There's no stains on the floor. There's no spots where the flooring is coming up or peeling nothing i mean oh you got some radio going you might be able to hear that so that works like it should this is that front ac unit i was talking about you've got seat belts throughout i'm telling you like this 2010 bluebird school bus with 86,000 miles is just nicer than it should be You've got a really nice, comfortable, plushy seat, air ride that works. It's got a shoulder harness. Let me see if I can get up on some of these for you. Here's your manufacturer information with your VIN. This is a school bus. That helps some people with their designations. It is set up for 44 passengers. These seats are traditional school bus seats though, so I've actually seen these where they've been set up and sold as you know three children per seat so that certainly is an option on this i'm going to do a walk around the outside but again i mean it is just nice i mean i'm not going to say i don't get excited about all of our trucks because 
if you guys start following any of my videos or if you know me at all, you know that I get excited about all of our inventory. I love these things. I love playing with all of the different apparatus and, you know, testing features and driving them and trying to convince Aaron that we need to pick up a small wrecked car with the, um, with the grapple attachment on the dump trucks. Like, I love doing ridiculous things like that. So, when I bought this really super practical yellow school bus, I did not expect to get really excited about it when it came in but I'm telling you I got really excited about it because it is so rare that you have an 86,000 mile bus that looks and smells new on the inside it is so rare that you have an 86,000 mile bus that is as clean and nice as this one this bus has lived here kind of in the Virginia area its whole life I'm not quite sure how good you can see but this undercarriage on this thing is so nice. I mean, it's got normal wear because it's got 86,000 miles on it, but there is no rust, no corrosion. You can still read all of the manufacturer stickers on the frame and the drive shaft and everything. You'll notice that the sides of both, both sides of this bus are super straight and clean. There's no rippling. There's no scratches. There's no any of that. Like, this is just a nice nice unit all the beacon lights work it just passed Virginia State safety inspection it didn't need a thing so they checked tires brakes suspension lights it's a pretty comprehensive uh, inspection process uh, similar to DOT but a little different because it's, it's more designed for uh, passenger cars but with the exception of the fact that paint on this is not super shiny and bright it is so I mean it is ready to go and I'm not gonna repaint it because I know there's a good possibility that Someone who buys it is going to want to do something different with it. They're going to make a different color or wrap it. I'm going to give you a quick view. I don't know if I can zoom in. Yeah. Here's a bus that we had a customer have wrapped. Not sure if you can see that very well. Um, we have got uh, 16 buses in inventory right now that range from uh, 15 passenger all the way up to 44. So if you have a different bus need, reach out. Um, we are at One Source Trucks in Burkeville, Virginia. The uh, phone number to call or text is 804-928-9099. Again, that's 804-928-9099. We are still setting up the new website for onesourcetrucks.com, um, but you can view our current inventory on our affiliate website of carnetcars.com. That's C-A-R-N-E-T-C-A-R-S uh, dot com, carnetcars.com. Uh, give me a call or a text message if you want to schedule a time to take a look at this or any of our other buses. Thanks so much.